out of a total of 25 teams that participated in the floor hockey national games, the Laikipia County team emerged victorious. This will be the second time a Kenya floor hockey team comprised of persons with intellectual disabilities will represent Kenya at the World Winter Games. We are so impressed by the training and the uh, that has been going on in this school. It was great effort that uh, despite the conditions that the athletes are training, they are able to come up with such a great and wonderful team. This team is representing our country in the next World Winter Games that will be held in uh, Austria in March. And we are so grateful for the, the coach, the teachers, and the athletes for the cooperation, which has enabled them to achieve this milestone. We are encouraging the others that uh, you don't need a special service to play pro hockey. You can play and win despite where you are. We are deep down in Laikipia, where the school is coming from, and we are doing, uh, the team is doing exceptionally well. Since we won the national games, we have been training vigorously because we are expecting to come with gold, nothing less than gold. So I'm training my, my, we are training very hard so that we shall come with that trophy. I want to really, really appreciate you on behalf of the Minister of Education and also the government of Kenya. What you are doing is very, very important because it shows that uh, having intellectual challenge does not mean that you cannot do anything, but it has shown that you have the potential to excel and go very, very far as a children, isn't it? So as you prepare to go and compete internationally, I want to let you know that the government is supporting you and we shall be able to support you up to the very end. So determined are the athletes. The prospect of their travel to Austria has had a positively profound effect on their lives and that of the community where they live in.